Longhorns and the Gonzaga Bulldogs in what should be a very competitive game offensively. They went 4 of 23 against Duke from three-point range, and a number of those were open shots, good pass. Rui Hachimura in off the bench, cannot finish for Gonzaga spectacularly in practice. But he has really struggled, not only in this tournament, but overall this year to knock down open threes. He's a guy, if you haven't seen him, they run a lot of offense through him, very comfortable at the high post. There is Rui Hachimura, a sophomore from Japan. Hachimura, as you mentioned, is a great athlete. And he's coming off the bench. He's one of the heirs apparent at Gonzaga, and they expect big things out of him. But Mark Few wants him to earn it, and he's going to have to earn it by coming off the bench. And mature. Obama needed to duck in. He's just not strong enough yet to take up that space against Killian Tilly. Roach lobs it up for Bamba. Can't get a shot off. Shot clock down to five. And again, just giving up some strength. Killian Tilly, a little bit too strong for him down on the block. Yeah, that's just a strength issue. Yeah. Perkins, a deep three. Have to find. He'll probably win more horse games. Good nice pass. Melson, baseline. And runs right into Bamba. They'll reset. Well, that was a heck of a closeout by Matt Coleman. Hachimura for three. And Bamba. Zagas got to get Jonathan Williams going. He's not scored yet in this game. Has a couple of turnovers. Tough shot there taken by Jones and a chance in transition now for the Zags. Kispert was wide a shot like that. He is so good off of ball screens and such a good creator. And also creates for others. Ositkowski the drive and the kick. Jones open for three. Texas not a good three-point shooting. And man, they can score. And it doesn't matter. They lose players year after year. And new ones come in. They've got a tremendous amount of confidence. Hachimura counted and a foul. Well, it is it is being and it's not and he, he wouldn't take take the credit he would he would put it to Dan Munson five slam pajama teams at Houston back in the 80s nice long pass from Melson to Hachimura that's how you has been off the first pass and when you're attacking a defense off the first action you're attacking a set defense when Texas has moved the ball and moved the defense they've had much better uh, success in attacking it Boy, and Gonzaga breaks the press again with ease, but Bamba strips it away. Not better than Gonzaga. At least I don't see it. Gonzaga, of course, losing a lot from the team that went all the way to the national championship game last year. Maybe that had something to do with the preseason of prognostications. Hachimura. Man. Hachimura's got 10 already. Just Coleman bounces one in. Hachimura's got a chance to be a guy that maybe not that many people have heard of now. And by March, everybody knows exactly who this guy is. Big-time athlete that has been... I don't want to say waiting his turn, but it's been essentially that yeah. ability. And he's going to keep getting better. We get a look now at Jakob Larson into the game for Gonzaga. Redshirt freshman out of Denmark, 6'11", 230. Good ball movement and a corner three. Pretty offense there is. And he was 6 of 22 in the PK-80 coming into this game. And he's a guy whose role is changing this year. He's going from a, a glue guy to having to be a primetime performer. And Silas Mels is the best defender on the perimeter. 40 to 23 Gonzaga after Texas led early 16 to 8. Bamba misses the long jumper. I know that's a shot that Mo Bamba can make. Dylan Osetkowski can make, make perimeter shots. But I'm not sure right now, off of one pass when they have been struggling to score, that's what they want to what they want to take. Look how the ball moves for Gonzaga, and then they get a shot that they want. Even that one of the New England Patriots, right. and I'm not sure the Patriots should make it. <laughs> Hashtag sarcasm. Yeah, how, how, does it, how does Alabama go from number one to everybody saying they're out of it because they lost at Auburn? Hachimura having himself a day. He's up to 12 points, six rebounds, two assists. There were just so many options, but he... Went right into a charge. I think that's the second charge that Melson has stepped in to take in this game. Again, the two-man game between Perkins and Hachimura. Roach elevates, can't finish. Hachimura with a rebound of the Zags on the run. And another foul going against Texas.
because the ball moves from side to side and the defense moves. And a lot of in a position where the defense makes a mistake and they take advantage of it. It, it was a long time ago now. But seconds. Boy, he had such a good day in the game against Duke. Wound up with 19 points, 7 rebounds, and 5 assists. And could have played much better. Same play. And Hachimura stays with it, but misses the follow. Sims down. Place to start. Perkins having a big day for the Zags. Hachimura got his man in the air and finishes. Get this thing made. I, I'm not sure Mark Few's going to sign off on this. He didn't seem overwhelmed by the idea when Jeff presented it to him. Well, he's a public figure. I don't think he has to yeah. sign off on it. Hachimura again. Rui and Few. Gonzaga that he could recite every line from uh, Drake songs and really made people take notice of the ability that he has through the course of the season. But they're not going to be able to do it by making individual plays. They're going to have to do it by playing five as uh, five as one on the offensive end. They got an interesting play the role of Mark Few. <laughs> yeah, but that was Tim Kirchin who sent him that. <laughs> who sent that in, wasn't it? <laughs> He'd have to work on his voice. Offensive foul on Hachimura. I don't know, by episeconds here, Coleman. <laughs> The Zags survive. They need overtime to do it, but they get it done. A couple of good friends, Shaka Smart and Mark Few, embracing after the game. The Tiger goes 2-1 and one here with the PK-80 Texas. Without a doubt on that play, Ryan. Hachimura puts his head down for Heisenberg.